uh, Wi-Fi warrior allegations. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dodging those <laughs> allegations. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, so PS2 where the best games are made. Honey Pop 4, top cut. Let's get it. Let's get into it right here. Oh, oh, what okay. the heck? We shine the what? Pikmin it off. It just kills the Pikmin. <laughs> yeah, like it, it's like this magnet. It has a hitbox. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> like it puts like a rainbow of dead <laughs> Pikmin around like a halo. Yep, yep. That is nuts. <laughs> so we talked uh, extensively about Meat Gunner specials, but one of my favorite Meat Gunner normals because the character has fun normals too. Yeah, it's that Nair. Uh, there's, there's the. There's the I'm, I'm like <laughs> fanboying right now. Over this. <laughs> this is wild. This is wild. <laughs> Sorry, what were you saying? <laughs> I, I was talking about a uh, Meat Gunner Nair. Yeah. Uh, one of my favorite normals from Meat Gunner. Yeah. It's actually Up Tilt. Actually, Up Tilt is my favorite. Oh, normal, Up Tilt is wild. Yeah, yeah. Up Tilt is wild, but. <laughs> oh, speaking of wild. <laughs> the God. double purple gets the spike immediately. You know what? The, what's kind of funny about uh, about C. Caleb, like, using the, the his magnet, uh, magnet yeah. like, it's, he's just giving. Him, uh, like giving 34 reasons to cycle through his Pikmin and find the ones he True. needs even faster. It's like, man, might as well throw these out. Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> the, the more the Pikmin I need, the more Olimar I watch and the more Olimar players I talk to, those type of things they're doing on purpose. Yes. They're like, I'm throwing the blue because obviously I'm not gonna get a grab kill, which is what yeah. these are for. So I'm just gonna throw them so that they either go out to die or they go and do a bunch of damage. Right. And if you're gonna like. Put in all this time to like use your magnet to get rid of it. That's fine. I'm, I'm collecting purple, so I'm, yeah. I'm just waiting for my time. We're hunting for the double purple, <laughs> the infamous thir double purple setup, the Myron Zone, if you will. Exactly, the infamous Myron Zone. Ooh, I like that back there too. Yeah. 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 Oh, nice. and then the stutter step into up tilt. Nice, nice. That was up tilt. Yeah, that's <laughs> up tilt. It's so fast and it's so strong. Uh. <laughs> okay, but yeah. Speaking of strong. <laughs> Jesus, the yeah, um, yeah. purple Pikmin back air. Taking the stock and uh, just broke, just broke that knee's spine uh, yeah. on impact. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, okay. see, the freaking oh, grenade, the grenade is plus on shield. So if you're shielding <laughs> that, the Me Gunner could just run up and grab. <laughs> yeah. So much shield pressure. Yeah. So crazy. Yeah, but I mean, 34 has been pretty much doing their thing. Yes. No, nothing has changed for them. They have not gotten uncomfortable by the least of uh, C. Caleb's shenanigans. I, I agree. And we're definitely seeing C. Caleb like, mixing up how they're dealing w with like the zoning by like, you know, zoning, using their own, his own zoning tools himself. You know what I mean? Like before oh. we were just like, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that kind of sucks. But you were saying. I mean, just like before we were just seeing like, uh, there was a game plan that C. Caleb had using that magnet. And now there's like a different plan. It, it's like meeting the zoning halfway. And it's working out really well. And C. Caleb is finding a lot more openings. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. the early uppy. OK, it worked out. Yeah, that uppy is also really tricky. You have like free control. So the angles you can do with it are very wacky. Yeah. Seeing like a lot more of these like retreating. Is that Nair, the, the blue? Or is it? No, that's neutral beam, I imagine, right? Which one? The, the uh, that the like the the laser gun. Oh, that laser! That's fair. That's fair. Yeah, okay. they, it gives you a little bit of drift. Um, yep. It kind of goes into like the advanced B gunner movement tech. Ooh. Wait, what? Okay, the okay. Invisible gun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, all of a sudden, this is a tight game. Yeah, very much so. The adjustments have been nuts. <laughs> yeah, see, Caleb found a couple of nice stocks, and now the Jeez. grenade pressure. <laughs> but. See, purple pick go straight through it. But yeah, you see that up, you could just go straight high right over your opponent. Yeah, that's, it, it, I didn't know you could curve it like that. Yeah, it, it doesn't have a pit box, that's the one trade right. off, but you have insane drift with it, so. It also just kind of looks dope. <laughs> it does look very dope. <laughs> There's no move that looks quite like that. Wow, I don't even know what C. Caleb hit 34 with, but now yeah. it has stage control. And yeah, Ooh, you see 30. by. Yeah, unfortunately, that is the blue Pikmin, so it's not going to kill with any of the normals. Yeah. Pretty much exclusively for uh, kill throws. But there goes the up smash. The red up smash lasted just long enough. Yeah. We saw a lot of, like, adaptation from both players in one game. Like, yeah. Like, there, uh, adaptation and counter -adapt adaptation all in, in one single game. 
That bodes well for the rest of the set. This oh, is going to be sure. exciting. Oh, oh yeah. So, so <laughs> they are fighting for the their life. <laughs> the, the loser of this game plays a Tata. So yeah, yeah, absolutely. You have to put everything into this. <laughs> Wow. wow. Okay, so C. Caleb had a had a pretty big upset on uh, Welfare Pickles, uh, upsetting the 12th seed as the number 40, 41. Wow. Wow. This is it's been a slaughter out there in Winner's Side today. Oh, like. for sure. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering because um, so when I was a top cut, I I basically busted, but um. If I had won my first set in Losers, I would have played Welfare Pickles, and I'm like, something sinister <laughs> has occurred. <laughs> I'm like, something sinister has occurred, and this, this, I'm glad I'm no longer a part of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. All right. So we're sticking sticking with the uh, Meat Gunner. I mean, I'm not too surprised, but, I mean, like I said, C. Caleb kind of made a name for himself with the Pac-Man. But yes. um, this Me Gunner has been coming out a lot more frequently, so definitely uh, not surprised. No. And see, that's like the movement tech I was talking about. Like you have an immediate um, short hop. I don't even think you short hop. Well, maybe you do short hop it. I don't know. But yeah. you have like the immediate downbeat, and it gives you like that magnet-like movement yes. uh, straight upwards. So it's really neat. That can you I, reverse it or like wave bounce it? Yeah, you could be nice. reverse, wave bounce it. Um, like that plus like the forward air, which gives you kind of like a core and back air effect. Yeah. Uh, you could just zip across the stage for a character whose uh, movement stats are actually pretty low. I think you've successfully me gunner pilled me today, honestly. <laughs> Dude, uh, it's a cool <laughs> character. It is. I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> this is very fun to watch. So much movement tech. Look yeah, 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 yeah. You just like, slip right by, but yeah. then you slip in the black <laughs> zone, uh, with the aid. Movement okay. is one thing, but taking stocks is another. <laughs> yeah. But having said that, though, it is it is cool. You, you stay pointed the same direction the whole time, yep. and you just get, have so much speed moving backwards. It's very interesting. Yeah. So wow. 34 is just rolling here. Had yes. the god tier lineup, uh, white and I two second. purples. <laughs> this is like wiggled around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like but I said, that's the god tier lineup. White, yeah. two purples because you throw the white. Does so much damage to them. Yeah. Um, well, seems yeah. seems like 5% of tick, pretty much. 22% for one projectile. And oh, oh. taking the stock there. Wait, this is going a little bit too fast. See, Caleb has not really even found their footing yet. Yeah. Oh, that was a... Oh, okay. Okay. The double shine, but yep. can't I like really the find them all. Okay, there goes the invisible bullet. Yep. Ooh. Oh man, but that wow, purple yeah. still. Oh. And you just died it! Oh, okay, you're good. Okay. You're good. I was scared for a second. That was at 60 something. That was a brutal kill screen, too. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but if game one says anything, see, Caleb can kind of find his way back and True. make this a game. Yeah, I mean, we, we weren't that far off from this situation when C. Caleb came back into the last game. It's like 40% more or so, but still, <laughs> C. Caleb did come back into it. Yeah. 34 just like dominating this, this half of this game now. Yeah, yeah. To be fair though, even though we saw game one get really close, uh, 34, they still uh, shut yeah. it down. Yeah, know? absolutely. Kept it calm. Didn't panic. Shut it down. Yep. I mean, that's the point in the bracket we're in though too. It's like, if you can't keep it calm at this point, you're not going to last too much longer. Yeah, Ooh. and honestly, the purples just seem like such a difficult thing for me, uh, Gunner, to deal with. Because yeah. they go through literally every projectile that C. Caleb has. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what a way to end out the set. C. Caleb himself becomes a projectile. Yes. Uh, yeah. Straight to the <laughs> top blast zone there. Are you a Pikmin? <laughs> <laughs>